Well, shits has really gone down this time. I want to get payback to that Lieutenant General, also known as my not-so-boss who has fired me, even though I have been the undercover police personal for years. Not only that but I now lost my FBI car which is just fucking fantastic. Yeah no shit, he really should have demoted you which should have been the right option instead of instantly getting rid of you. Also, Aiden, who set it my house on fire, why did you let it burn down? Like come on, even though I used setting houses on fires but this was not in real life. I wasn't even bothered, blame the stupid firefighters who are not so fighter cause they died there for being stupid. Man, that has got to be the worst that I seen, besides, we have rented a hotel for just now. Not to also mention that my life is now even tough now as it is. Well I don't care anymore. We should go and teach your boss a lesson. No Eden. Let's just leave it. Eh? After what happened there, let's just not. Alright then. So I have a better idea. What's your plan then? Well since that my evil is coming back to me now since I am no longer an actual cop. Wait, so you mean that? That's right. I'm now becoming a mafia. You're now starting your mafia business? Sweet. You are my inner boss. Now get dressed and meet me in my office. Okay. Now Owen is becoming the evil criminal empire again now? Like committing crimes and stealing businesses? Well he is a Sith Lord so that might explain the situation. You are supposed to get dressed. I know. You don't have to shout, bud. Shut the hell up or I'll break your legs. Jeez, Aiden. I'm sorry, now back off. I love the idea. Being a criminal empire is awesome. And don't get me wrong. There we go, that should be it. I honestly look like a badass right now. Red Star's assist, boy am I glad to see you again. Yeah well let's just say that I'm very happy to be able to hang out with you again. I also see that you are already familiar with the business I'm about to start. I heard you're doing a mafia business so I had to join in. That's good to hear, Copper Red Star's assist. Aiden, what took you so long to get dressed? Look, I just had to check something okay? But wait. Ayo, Red Star's assist, what's up my man? It's been a while. Hello there Aiden. How you been? I'm fine, but the world is pretty toxic right now. Alright fellas, now it's time for a plan about what you're in for. Now I have been planning on doing this for a long time. There's this guy called Craig. You guys know him right? Yes. That blue deared retarded bitch. Yeah, him. He owes me money. And the amount is $2,000 and he is not willing to pay me back after borrowing a technical machine. Now way, that's a lot, what do you think we should do? Well I'm about to tell you this, I want y'all to go to his house, and knock on the door, give him a piece of our mind and force him to pay us the money he owes. I know what you're about to say, but boss, isn't he not in the community anymore? Well let me tell you this. He lied. Really? No way. I knew he was lying this whole time. That's the reaction I want to see. Now, let's go. <laughs> Sending anonymous message to Craig that we're coming for you. I still can't believe that he lied about leaving the entire community. Like seriously. I gave him a chance. He has blew it. What you do on that technical machine thing or whatever? I used to rattle on it. And post stuff, as usual. Okay, fair enough. It's just the way you said rattle it, made it a bit. Eh, hey, you know. Sometimes I just say different words. Alright, let's make sure he doesn't make it harder for himself. I'm on it. The hell do y'all want? 
Well Craig, the reason why we're here to crash your party or whatever is because you owe us money. Yeah, uh, yeah, it's about the technical machine, right? How did you know? I catched the email, and I would knew that Owen has sent you. Are you gonna pay us back? Or will you suffer? Fine, let me just count to see how much I brought. I'm not taking actions right now cause I'm busy working, so you guys will be lucky this time but this is the only time and that's it. Wow, I wasn't expecting that at all. Here, just take the money and leave me alone you creepy mafias. Sweet, just let me make sure it isn't fake. Whatever, I'm going back inside. While Red Star's assist, that was easier than I thought it would be, Craig wasn't normally this generous to us. Come on let's go back to the car. Not gonna lie, I'm pretty surprised with how smooth that went. Yeah Craig wasn't bothered taking actions cause he's busy, but we got the money. Good. He has made a wise choice. Hey, stop the car. What do you see? You see the shop. It's owned by the Blue Deers. We're gonna steal that business from them. Okay, should I go in? No, let Red Star's assist do this. I'm on it. Hey Denny, that guy looked kind of familiar. I think that car looks kind of familiar. Hello there, welcome to the shop. This is quite the business you got there. You know it could be even better when you're working for a different boss. Oh god, look, the boss that I'm working for is completely fine. I don't care will you just leave. It will be a shame if I bought this place. Oh shit. I just have an awful feeling. Come on rappers, I'm sure things will be. Uh, what happened? Denny, are you okay? Oh no. The place has been bombed. I knew something was off. Uh, Craig is not gonna be happy about this. Sorry Raps. It's just what's meant to be done. Let him have it. Ouch. Oh, 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 oh,